Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about can load card in Angular with a real-time example. Okay, so in Angular, basically the cards are used to protect the routes and prevent unauthorized access to uh, certain parts of your application, right? And this can load card specifically, uh, it's a special type of a guard that prevents the lazy loaded models from being loaded if certain conditions are not met. In the previous video, we saw what is lazy loading and uh, how we can uh, avoid unnecessary models being loaded if they are not supposed to be loaded. And we're going to use the can load guard for that. Come, let's dive in. Just to give an example, uh, just to recap. So this application is right now configured with the lazy loading. So when I refresh this, you can see all these uh, important files are loaded. And then if I click on the product, it loads a specific one on demand. Okay, now let's say uh, I am clicking on the admin section and I don't want this admin uh, JS file to be downloaded if they are not authorized to be even go to there. Now let's click on this and you can see right now the admin section is downloaded, right? Now how can we prevent this? If let's say we uh, the user has to be logged in when they go to admin section and this one should not be uh, downloaded and we're going to see how to take care of that. So this is the route and in the route, what I'm going to do is I'm going to use something called can activate, can load guard. And then we will provide auth guard. If we go inside the auth guard, you can see I'm implementing the can load inside the auth guard. And can load is basically checking if the user has been logged in or not. And if the user is logged in, it will return true. If not, it will put them back to the login screen. Now let's go back to home page. Let's refresh this. Let's clear off all these things. Let's refresh this. So we're all set. Now again, I'm going to show you. If I click on product on demand, it's downloaded. Okay. But initially you saw when I click on this, there was another JS file which was downloaded. Now I'm going to click on this. You see this, that file was not downloaded. It was directly put me into the login screen. It did not download that module. Basically, we don't need to show the source code of that admin module for the user who is not even, you know, authorized to look into this model. So let me just log in with something. The moment I'm signed in, you can see a new JS file got downloaded, which is the admin module. And it makes sense completely now to get into this page. And this section was not downloaded and the scan load was preventing it. And that's what the usage of the can load card. I hope you enjoyed this video. And in the next video, I'm going to show you how to, how to apply the preload module downloading concept in the lazy loading so that all the feature modules are downloaded after the initial load of the application. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, Write it in the comment section and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. If you like my video, don't forget to subscribe my channel, like it, share it, comment it, and never forget to click on the bell icon.